Cayo Santiago is a small island off the east coast of Puerto Rico. In 1938, Clarence Ray Carpenter, who is often considered kind of the grandfather of American primatology, released 409 rhesus monkeys onto the island to start a population. The monkeys have been there ever since, and we continue to study them on a day-to-day -day basis. I consider myself to be an evolutionary biologist, and I'm primarily interested in understanding evolutionary processes and how they have created and maintained the incredible diversity of species and life that we see on our planet. Hurricane Maria came directly through the southeastern and eastern part of Puerto Rico. Maria has caused widespread devastation um, across Puerto Rico. We were very worried about a lot of people. Some of the staff members that work for the Caribbean Primate Research Center have lost everything, suffered really badly. Once we realized that we were not getting any information at all about the status of Cayo Santiago, how badly it had been affected, whether the monkeys were even still there. Together with um, some of my colleagues at uh, the University of Washington in Seattle, at the University of Pennsylvania, and at the University of Exeter, we had discussion about chartering a helicopter. The associate director for the Cayo Santiago field station, she was able to take that flight. They landed on Cayo Santiago, took aerial footage, made an assessment. She was able to see hundreds of monkeys. She was also able to go over Punta Santiago, collect some footage. So she took some photographs of a message people had painted on the street, which was SOS, and then written in Spanish, we need food and water. When she got back to San Juan, she was eventually able to get one video and some photographs, including images of that SOS out. And straight away I realized that the latter image was important, so I tweeted that out. Fortunately, that image kind of went viral on Twitter and appeared in all kinds of places. So it was on CNN, and Kim Kardashian tweeted it out, which was kind of crazy. Directly in response to that image, the governor of Puerto Rico flew in on a helicopter full of aid to Punta Santiago, distributed it aid, met with people in Punta and, and took photographs with him and the community literally on that painted sign um, on the street and made a point of saying, you know, your request was heard, we are here with, with aid. For the status of the monkeys, we've accounted for all of the social groups and there are many individuals left in all the social groups. You look at the island and you look at the devastation, you think, how can monkeys survive that? But the, the monkeys are creative and very resilient. They hide, they huddle, they find places. Um, they know the terrain and the habitat extremely well. Their resilience is really, really impressive. <laughs>